Hello everyone, welcome to Salesforce Predator. In this channel, we discuss about various concepts and technologies in Salesforce. In this video series, we are discussing about Salesforce Lightning Flows. In today's video, we'll see how we can use quick actions to launch flows. Okay, so we'll go to our Salesforce org and we already have one flow. So in this flow, what we were doing, we are having a screen element where we have four fields, status, case origin, subject and account. Now for now, we'll remove this account field from this screen. So for that, first we need to remove it from create record. Okay. Uh, why we are removing it, we'll see in some time. Okay. So uh, also we'll remove this description because it was a formula field created, right? So now I'll go to my screen element and I'll click on delete this field okay and i'll save now uh, whenever we need to include a flow inside a record page so for that uh, we need to create a record id variable so that uh, the parent record id is populated into that record id variable so we need to include our flow uh, into account record page right so for that we'll create a variable record id and it will hold account record id into it okay so we'll click on new resource we'll click on variable and we'll specify it as record id okay value from account record page and we'll specify data type as text okay and i will specify available for input over here and click on done okay now we have three elements over here so we'll keep it as it is and in create records what we'll do we'll add one more field and we'll specify account id here and we'll specify variable record id into it okay so whenever we'll include this flow inside the accounts record page account id will go into record id and same will be used to create case record so that the case record created will be linked to the corresponding account record okay we'll click on save and we'll activate this flow okay now we need to include it into a quick action on account page so what we'll do is we'll go to account sorry we'll go to object manager We'll go to account and from here we'll go to buttons links and action and we'll click on new action now we have this action type over here so we'll select a flow and here we'll use create case flow okay so uh, this is available for selection so we'll select it and uh, for label we'll specify create case okay and we'll save this now we have created quick action we need to include this quick action into accounts page layout okay now we'll go to page layouts so in page layout we'll select account layout and we'll go to mobile and lightning actions we'll search for our create case action yeah it is there and we'll drag and drop into salesforce mobile and lightning experience action okay now we'll click on save okay and now we will go to any of the account record we'll click on this account now we have to find create case action okay so we'll go here and we'll yeah so we can see create case action has been added to this page layout so if i click on this create case it will launch our flow you can see the screen elements over here so we have three fields status case origin and subjects so let's say i'll specify as escalated i'll specify as web and subject will be quick action 
case okay and i'll click on next so it should be creating a new case record right so we'll check if it is there or not so if i go there in the case related list i can see a new case created by using quick action okay so this is how you use flow inside quick action to create a records if you have any questions you can add it in the comment section and do not forget to subscribe this channel thank you for watching